Today, another bike tour, and if you know what this is already, you know exactly what I'm going to say about it. It looks complex, it looks like something a dentist would extract teeth with, and for the price of this one in particular, you wouldn't be far off the mark there. But like a lot of things, there are alternatives that do the exact same thing. This is the official Park Tool BT2, known as the fourth hand tool. Retails around 50 US dollars. There's also a version of this from Pedro's, Ice Tools, and BW at much lower price points, weighing in at around half the price of the Park BT2. I'll put links to those in the video description, but as this is the one that I have in my possession today, it's the one that I'm going to show you. My aha light bulb moment with this tool was when I figured out how it works with this pinch point here, grabbing the cable, pulling it tight, and locking it in place. So I have an example here before we jump over to the bike and I'll show you how it works on the bike. Here is a brake caliper, cable pull, obviously. And if I wanted to pinch that down, I'd have to use two hands to guess where that is and hopefully that's pulled tight, but maybe it's not. It gets a bit clumsy, look, to be honest. It can be done, it's how I've done it in the past, but ever since grabbing this tool, I will never do it this way again. So, grabbing this tool here, cable in, You can see the cable's gone in there, pinches it tight, pushes it up, locks in place. There we go, we can take our hands off. That's ready to pinch down, like so. Squeeze, unlock, and we are done. What does it look like out in the bike? Let's have a look at the giant TCR and installation of the rear and front brake cables. With the freshly installed brake cable, there is a lot to grab onto with the tool. So opening that up, pinching the cable down, clamping it in place and using the locking mechanism to hold everything where it needs to go. A little bit too tight on that, opening it up just a little bit. Tool off and double checking the brakes. Quick alignment adjustment and we are done. As easy as that. Okay, over to the front. Same deal. Pinching the cable down, locking it in place, and we have all the hands to do the rest of the work. Job done. So there we are for today. A quick look at the Park Tool BT2, known as the fourth hand tool, or a cable stretcher, or a cable puller. I'll call this one very, very handy. As mentioned earlier on, there are alternatives to this, which I'll put links to in the video description below. And with that, thanks for watching.